So my thanks to Your Excellency and everyone at the Australian Brain Foundation and all the donors. It is a great honour to accept this research gift award. I'd like to further extend my thanks to my fellow investigators and supervisors, my friends and family, and my fiance. I'll now give you some background into our study. Try to imagine that if every time you heard music you saw an explosion of colour, or if every time you ate cauliflower you tasted purple, well for 4.4% of the population this is their everyday reality. Synesthesia is the neurological phenomenon often described as a mixing of senses. It is vastly underreported or underrecognized due to the inherently personal nature of your own experience and perceptions. It is also vastly underreported due to the perceived stigma of reporting such unusual events. On the veracity of these experiences, the late, Oliver, the late neurologist Oliver Sacks wrote, brain imaging now gives unequivocal evidence for the simultaneous activation or co-activation of two or more sensory areas within the cerebral cortex in synesthetes. Our research focuses on the most common form, colour grapheme synesthesia, which affects 1.2% of the general population. For a person with this form, a grapheme, which is a number, letter, symbol and words, are perceived with an experience of colour. When my friend first told me that this was the world she lived in um, and that it had caused um, a nightmare learning mathematics, um, I felt my own pain of sympathetic frustration, imagining how confusing this would be. The problem that caused this feeling was one of perceptual or mental conflict. Today I've brought a prop to help uh, demonstrate this to everyone. For those of you who can't see, this is the word yellow written in blue. As you know, something just isn't right. The phenomenon demonstrated, which is normally demonstrated here is something known as the Stroop effect, whereby people are slower at reading the word, at naming the colour of the ink, blue, because the word is written yellow. As I hope you can all appreciate, when you try to name the word, name the colour of the ink, blue, you can't help but read the word yellow. I hope you can appreciate that this is fighting your instincts. So, I asked my friend, would a colourful calculator help? After using one I designed to do some financial planning on a holiday, she wrote to me, it is brilliant. I cried the first time I used it. Spending my entire life being told I had cognitive difficulties when it came to maths, everything made sense. It was actually quite life-changing. As you can probably guess, I'm now studying this calculator in great depth. During the study, I measure participants' um, function on a mathematics test using the colourful calculator and a standard black one. The group is performing these experiments on a tablet device and using the forward-facing camera to capture the, the participants' emotional reaction up to 15 times per second. With potentially more than 80 million people worldwide having colour grapheme synesthesia, it is my sincere hope that this simple device can not only help their function, emotion and learning, but also bring them that same sense of relief and correctness that my friend experienced. As a young researcher, this gift will surely contribute to reaching those aims. Thank you.